Hello, I'm Dr. Debra Davis from Pittsburgh's Center for Environmental Oncology. Today I want to talk to you about a problem that is in 35 million American addicts, but nobody knows about it. It involves insulation. Padding used to keep addicts warmer can in fact cause deaths 30 and 40 years later. Let me explain why. Tremolite is a contaminant that contains asbestos, and zonalite insulation, which may or may not be labeled zonalite, can be contaminated with tremolite. And what we know, because the EPA tried to tell us, is that 35 million American homes today may have this in their attics, and a little bit of disturbance of that insulation by someone going up to fix a lighting problem or a heating problem can result in a chance that they will get a crippling and lethal disease some 30 or 40 years later. Mesothelioma is a cancer of the lining of the sac that contains the lungs and the tumor grows and slowly people suffocate to death. They're unable to breathe. It is caused by exposure to asbestos. Asbestos can be 50 times smaller than a human hair and these ultrafine particles can be deeply inhaled into the lung and once they get in they don't get out. And what we know now from research done all over the world is that asbestos really does kill people. The United States and Canada are the only two modern industrial nations not to have banned asbestos. Christy Todd Mitten Whitman tried to ban asbestos in the first George W. Bush administration, and she was turned back by the Office of Management and Budget. So it's time for America and Canada to do the right thing. Asbestos should be banned, and people have a right to know whether or not it is in their attics. What can you do? You have to call someone who is a licensed asbestos inspector, find out whether there is asbestos in your attic, and let them decide whether you should leave it alone or remove it. And if it is removed, it has to be done safely. Thank you.